Welcome to Century One. In this video, I will be discussing the integrated version of Plan Explorer within the Century One platform. There are several ways to open Plan Explorer within the Century One platform. Among them is to click on the new Plan Explorer session icon in the toolbar. Another such way is to open a Plan Explorer session by clicking on the open button under the plan column in the top SQL, blocking SQL, or deadlocks grid views. Finally, you can click on any of the data points representing a captured plan in the query history graph within the top SQL tab. Once the Plan Explorer session opens in a new tab, you can see three additional tabs at the top left side of the session. The Command Text tab provides you with an editable version of the query text for the statement or batch that is being analyzed. This allows you to make changes and then get an estimated or actual plan by clicking on the corresponding buttons in the toolbar to see how these changes impact the execution plan. Plan Explorer also provides you with a view of the version history for a session when you make changes and get an estimated or actual plan within the session. You can view this version history by selecting View and then Plan History from the toolbar. Alternatively, you can click on the Plan History tab that is docked to the left side of the client by default. The next tab within Plan Explorer that I will discuss is the Wait Stats tab. When an actual plan is retrieved with related stats within a Plan Explorer session, the Wait Stats tab will be displayed. This tab will contain any wait types that were collected, as well as any associated wait or signal times. The final tab within Plan Explorer is the Results tab. The Results tab is broken up into three sections. The first section is the Statement section. This section displays a logical breakdown of the entire plan tree. This becomes especially important when navigating multi-statement plans. The second section is the General Query and Plan Information section. This section displays the query text and query XML. This section is automatically synchronized when changes are made within the Command Text tab and a new estimated or actual plan is generated from the toolbar options. The final section is the Plan Details section. Because this section hosts such a wealth of information about the execution plan and its many tabs, it will be covered in a separate video.